Don Joy's exact ROM knee brace with swivel and snap features, anti-migration foam, and dynamic suspension frame provides post-op patients with a lightweight, comfortably fitting brace. The exact ROM is designed for quick and easy application and is an excellent solution for patients who want a stable, secure, and durable knee brace. The exact ROM comes in a handsome bag with a Ziploc top, handles that make it easy to carry and store, and a white space for the patient's name. Now, for the easiest post-op application of the brace, fit the brace before surgery if at all possible. To discover the adjustable features of the exact ROM brace, unfasten the strap ends near the black buckles. Open the brace flat to its widest position by pulling both of the uprights apart. Telefit technology enables each of the four straps to telescope independently so you can keep the straps away from the surgical site. To adjust the brace, depress the slider button to telescope the paddles. Make sure that both bars are equal in length and that each strap paddle is indexed to the same position on each upright. One of the unique features of the Exact is the range of motion hinge. The Exact hinge enables clinicians to adjust the brace in a manner that works best for the patient. To adjust the hinge, depress the flexion and extension buttons, then rotate the hinge until you've aligned the button center to the desired angle. Release the push button and make sure it is fully retracted to the extended position. The exact ROM hinge provides extension settings from minus 10 to 90 degrees and flexion settings from minus 10 to 120 degrees. To use the red quick lock feature, slide the button inward until the lock is engaged at 0, 15, or 30 degrees. Make sure the uprights do not rotate. Once you're familiar with the exact's different features, it's much easier to apply and adjust the brace. When you're ready, place the patient's leg on top of the flat brace. Apply the shorter upright to the thigh. Then adjust the brace until each upright is aligned to the center line of the medial and lateral sides of the patient's leg. Adjust the strap lengths one by one to remove the slack from the posterior aspect of the brace. Remove the strap from the Velcro retainer and, by pulling away from the body, remove slack from the back of the brace. Reattach the strap to the Velcro to ensure posterior strap length remains the same. Check to make sure the uprights are aligned on both the medial and lateral sides of the patient's leg. The quick snap buckles attach easily and swivel in place for a quick fit. Start with the upper calf strap and clip each of the black buckles onto the slider. You'll hear a click when it's properly fastened. Next, pull on the loose ends to tighten the straps. The swivel tabs and buckles provide a close fit while the sticky foam helps keep the brace in place. Cut off or fold in any excess strap. If you cut it, Reposition the alligator strap end to the new edge of the strap and secure it. To disengage each buckle, simply squeeze both sides of the buckle until it releases. Bend the hinge to add varus or valgus contouring. Bend each bar by holding the thigh calf bar firmly against a solid surface. Apply a gentle, constant pressure to the hinge in the desired direction. Bend each sidebar an equal amount above and below the hinge. The adjustability of the exact ROM makes it suitable for a wide range of patients recovering from knee surgery, and it provides those patients with a controlled and precise range of motion. In some cases, it may be necessary to troubleshoot the exact ROM. For example, if the hinge moves forward on the knee, unbuckle the straps and make sure the uprights are midline on each side of the leg. Then, pull the slack out of the straps on the back side of the leg. Snap the buckle in and fasten the Velcro strap end down. In other cases, the strap may be too long or it won't Velcro securely. In that case, properly align the uprights at midline of the leg. Then remove the alligator Velcro strap end. Either cut the excess strap with scissors or fold it under. Then reapply the alligator strap end so that the strap end is on the anterior portion of the leg. 
If the hinges don't reach the knee, you'll need to remove the brace from the patient's leg. Bend each bar by holding the thigh calf bar against a solid surface. Apply gentle and constant pressure to the hinge in the desired direction. Bend each sidebar an equal amount above and below the hinge. On some patients, the brace may migrate down the leg. In that case, make sure the straps are snug and the uprights are at midline of the leg. You can also telescope the calf portion of the brace down to the ankle to ensure the brace stays in place. If the padding is dirty, let your patient know that it may be removed, hand washed, and air dried. The Don Joy Exact ROM is an excellent brace for post-operative knee patients. It's lightweight, durable, and provides patients with the comfort, support, and range of motion they need during the recovery process.